What's up Star Wars fans, welcome back to another 6 inch Black Series Star Wars figure review. This one is Hoth Leia, as uh, this is review number one of two, I'll be doing the Han Solo that came with her next. Um, I did get that exclusive box set, um, which, is, which is a really nice display package if you wanted to keep them in the box. Um, and this Leia has also just come out in a single release in the most recent wave. Um, as with and uh, Han Solo will come later, I believe, ne early next year, at some point. Um, now, I recently reviewed uh, the Bespin Escape layer, and I did make note that this figure here uh, would be reusing pretty much all the same parts, minus the um, the vest and the change of head sculpt, um, being that she has different hairstyles in the two different scenes. Um, I'm actually mistaken, so forgive me for my misinformation in my Bespin layer review because having them in hand now, as you can see, there are some small differences. Um, Hoth Leia is wearing her boots sort of up higher. Um, well, she's wearing boots, whereas she's just got sort of sort of small shoe boots on the Bespin version here on the left. And the, the left arm there. She's got the sort of communication device on her arm on the Hoth version. So there are, there are a couple of little differences there. And of course Hoth Leia is wearing white gloves. So there are some subtle differences, but they're there. So again, um, <laughs> ignore my misinformed um, information <laughs> in my last, in my review of this Bespin Leia. But uh, let's have a look at this one anyway, because this is a doozy. Uh, this is a really good figure. And of course, now that I've started recording, I've forgotten the other accessories. They're in the accessory box. She comes with some welding goggles and the welder um, that she's using when she's helping Han with some repairs. And they fit really well. Um, so I do apologize for forgetting about them, but I've started recording now, so <laughs> I'm a bit too slack to go and get them. But we'll get nice and close up with this one. I hope that's hope that looks okay. Really nice, really nicely done. Um, these last two layer figures have been absolutely outstanding. And uh, yeah, despite the fact that they did revisit that a new hope layer. Um, in the 40th anniversary line, they sort of fixed it up a little bit. I think they can do it again and give us this quality for for that new a new hope layer. Um, it's a it's a should do. It really is. Um, just put it back out on a single release, one one per case, so everyone that wants one can get one. Um, yeah, I think that would be a good thing. Otherwise, she comes with a rebel blaster, which fits well in her hand. You can see the sort of rank plate there on her on her vest. Nice details there on the communicator on the on the wrist or on the forearm there. So you can see you've got the same patterns as the uh, track suit she's wearing at Bespin. Obviously, it's the same same suit. She just puts it back on. But yeah, this photo reel technology is is unreal. It really is. It's, I've, I've said it many times. Um, it's really taken Hasbro's six-inch line to to a next level, and that is, yeah, it's 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 there. It's it's really good. So I hope I really hope they keep it up. I don't think they'll go back now. I think a backward step would be wouldn't be good for the line at all. So. Articulation wise, she's got the ball hinged, uh, the ball jointed head. I think there's the neck joint there as well. It may not move a lot, I'm not sure. Um, ball hinged shoulders, elbows, wrists, uh, upper torso joint, sort of around the middle. Ball hinged at the, what are those parts called? The hips. Uh, the thighs swivel there, the double joints in the knees, and the, the ball hinge in the ankles. So. Yeah, pretty standard articulation for this one. It's good range of motion though, and you can get some pretty cool poses with her. Um, so they haven't missed a beat there, but definitely a nice, a nice addition. Um, 
and uh, we'll, next video we'll take a look at the Han Solo so stay tuned for that one uh, any thoughts and feedback drop them in the comments below and till the next video may the force be with you